Is Isaiah the greatest player you ever played with? I think so. I think. Did I, you not play with Michael? I did. Did you not play with Shaq and Kobe? Yeah. Well, damn, what happened? Isaiah was six feet tall. Two-time champion, finals <laughs> MVP, 12-time All-Star, two-time All-Star game MVP, all-time All-NBA. Yeah, but I think Michael was the greatest. I, I say that, and, and he knows why I say that, to piss him off. I used to say to him, uh, money, these people, you're Messiah. I, I said in 2,000 years, in 2,000 years, they're going to be worshiping you. Like, they, they're going to be Jesus who? Like, you're the Messiah. Yeah. And he was like, shut up, Sal. And I go, dog, think about it. Some people literally worship their whole lives and have everything based upon you. And if they met you, you wouldn't talk to them. You wouldn't say anything to them. <laughs> like, you'd be like, yo, security. But some people are, like, stuck in that piece. And and I said to, I would say to uh, James Worthy, I said, can you believe the way they treat Michael? He goes, yeah, skinny little Michael. They acting like skinny little Michael is the best player to because when we were in college, he was just skinny. Right. You know, we would laugh about it. We'd laugh about it. He was like, Mike Jordan. Yeah, it was like, yeah, yeah. I, you know, he was, when he went and tried out, it was a, Clyde Drexler was going at him. This person was going yeah. at him. And then he just, he turned into uh, like this unbelievable, it was like Little Wayne when he was part of the Hot Boys. And yeah. then he turned into Wheezy. But the thing, <clears throat> you've been around him. I've never seen anything like Mike. The aura around him. Yeah. The man is, he levitating. Eddie Murphy. He, I've never been. Eddie, I, Mur Eddie Murphy. I've never been around Eddie. I've been around some famous actors and actresses and seen some famous people. But Jordan is like, Jordan levitates. Yeah. That man, he, he Yeah, he changed it. You know, it's so funny, too, because you, 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 you base everything upon Michael Jordan. Even Tom Brady is based upon Michael Jordan. Right. Uh, he's the Jordan of football. Yeah. He's the Jordan of basketball. He's, he's the Jordan, Jordan of golf. Of yeah, yeah, that kind of stuff. Um, what was the other cat? So I, I did a a friend of mine, I didn't say his name, you know, wanted to meet Beyonce. Uh, and this is right before September 11th. And we're at this at this event in New York. And so I <laughs> introduced Beyonce to him. And she goes, uh, hi. And she goes, John, I want to meet Michael Jackson. I said, I felt different. I, I said that. I said, I felt different. I didn't know he was in. Like, he literally changed the molecules in the room. Right. Michael Jordan does the same thing. Yes. Uh, I, I begged him to go out with us in Philadelphia. We go out. We go in the back way. We smoke right. cigars in the joint. And the owner of the, store, of the club comes and goes, Michael Jordan in my club? Cut the music off and turn the lights on. He wanted everybody to see Michael Jordan was in his club. I'm telling you, he changes the way people move. His, his new wife is is the bomb, too. Because it, it, her making him do normal things yeah. is dope. That's good for him. Right. You know, it's kind of crazy. Because he's very isolated early on. I mean, he didn't yeah. really do any. He didn't do, I mean, really anything publicly. No, we, we were in Monte Carlo, and uh, uh, Marvis ha uh, uh, Hagler mm -hmm. was, you know, he moved to Italy. Right. And he was in San Tropez, and he saw Michael. And Mike was more impressed to see him uh, Marvin. Marvin Hagler, then, then the, they were just happy to talk to one another. Right. And then we were walking in the street, and I go, how you like this? He goes, no one's bothering me. I go, because you, you make less than them. We're in Monte Carlo. <laughs> like, <laughs> bro, you, 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 you're not making anywhere close to this money right here. So him, I, you know, I took it for granted, because I can go anywhere. Right. And um, I can go anywhere. And then I, don't y'all know who I think I am? I'm supposed to be up front. <laughs> but he can't go anywhere. No. So it's it's. Do you think he's the most recognizable person in the world? Used to be. Who do you think it is now? Kanye West. <laughs> if I'm if I'm wrong, this is why I told you he's brilliant. He uh, is brilliant. I I, I would have said the only people that could probably rival him, and as far as face recognition, probably Cristiano Ronaldo. No. Uh, no. Probably Messi. No, uh -oh. they're just soccer players. They got to have their jerseys on. Nah, people know them. I, I guarantee you. That man got 500 million followers. A half a billion. Kanye got six billion dollars. <laughs> 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 no, you do realize like most like Elon Musk. Music transcends everything. You so you think you think. Kanye is more recognizable than Jordan, Messi, or, or Ronaldo. 
right now? No. Like, some people didn't know Michael Jordan played basketball. No, but you know what he is. Or Tiger. When Tiger was at his height. You don't know what Tiger looked like now. Tiger got a limp. You know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna say nothing mean, <laughs> Shannon. He did. I, I'm, I'm waiting. He 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 ain't got that walk anymore. He doesn't. You know, he doesn't show up in those spots anymore. He, he's downplaying it, trying to. You know, he's letting everything die down before Tiger strikes back. He's ready to prowl. You think he could? You you think we'll ever see one more glimpse of what he gave us a couple years ago at the Masters? If Tiger got into hot yoga, this is true statement. If Tiger got into yoga, he'd be back. It'd be hot yoga. He'd be back to the Tiger we knew because every other distraction got in Tiger. Life got in the way. Right. So once he centers himself, he's unstoppable. Are you sad? Are you disappointed or upset? Sad, I guess sad is a better choice of words, to see how it's playing out between Scotty and Michael. Did you ever think it, you, did you ever think it would get to this? Or no, because I I, th- I always think Michael. I thought they were I thought they were cool. I thought they were clowning. I thought they clown. You know, he's clowning it. You know, Michael yeah. clowns him and stuff, right? Um, I think the last dance did this because Jordan said some things in the last dance. Two, because if it's the la- first of all, well, Michael won't say anything he didn't say to your face. But no, but here's the thing: if why would you put Scotty not Jordan? You weren't there. Why would you put Scotty not going into the game in 94 when you weren't there? Why would you put that in your documentary? It's like me. I got something, but I'm going to put something that's not that's not pleasing to John in my documentary. What the hell? You looking like, what the hell I got to do with Did this? Did I do it? This is the deal. Scotty was wrong in 94. Yes. And this was part of the story. On how Tony Kuko got to it and how, but it, that was that, that didn't last. That that ain't part of Jordan's story. Jordan wasn't on the team. Well, he also didn't edit it. it, it but you know, but I'm saying, you know, he just the executive. He, they had yeah, to say he's he executive he, producer. Yeah, he you got he got final say. He got some cut. No shoe. He don't. Jordan had say in that. No, he didn't. Man. Hey, you and Shannon, I'm gonna tell you right now. You had the best interview with uh, Lamar Odom. Period. And period. Vlad almost had it. Vlad almost had that interview. Boy, didn't, he didn't show up. I'm telling you, you had the best interview. Appreciate that, Lamar. He said, seriously, he said no to everybody else but you and felt comfortable telling you his truth. You know how crazy that is? Yeah. I, I wish you would have wanted to cut something out and I was exa- and I was producer on here. I'd be, Shannon, you know you're right. We're going to cut it out. And then I'll have somebody go get you drunk while we put it put on back, the air. Put it back in. <laughs> <laughs> Say sorry to you after we get the points. You know what to do. Hit the subscribe button and become an official member of Club Shay Shay, where we do something before two something.